Other news now, now 14 days into the partial government shutdown, both sides don't appear to be any closer to a deal. Yeah, congressional leaders are expected to meet again with the president at the White House later today. That's twice in one week. And Michaela McDonald has more now from the control room. That's right, Danielle and Patrick. This will be the second meeting between the president and congressional leaders at the White House this week to try to resolve the shutdown. This partial government shutdown has now been going for two weeks. The main thing holding up reopening the government, the disagreement about $5 billion that President Trump wants for a border wall. Yesterday, Democrats took control of the House, passing two measures aimed at ending the government shutdown. But the proposals do not include money for a border wall. The legislation is not expected to get anywhere in the Senate, and President Trump has said he would veto both measures. The wall about, you can call it a barrier, you can call it whatever you want, but essentially we need protection in our country. We're not doing a wall. Does anybody have any doubt that we're not doing a wall? And this shutdown has has meant hundreds of thousands of federal workers have not been getting paid. And there is now a risk that tax refunds could be delayed with IRS workers furloughed. Michaela McDonald, Eyewitness News.